Hi there, I'm Steve, and today we're going to do a science experiment showcasing water density. Now, to do this experiment properly, you're going to need a few things. Four cups of warm water, some food coloring, sugar, one tablespoon, something to stir with, a baster, and a test tube or a very narrow glass. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put the food coloring in each cup of warm water, and each color is going to represent a different density of water. Now once the food coloring is in your warm water, stir it up so it's a nice solid color. Now the first glass, the red glass, we're not going to put any sugar in whatsoever. But the yellow glass, we're only going to put one tablespoon's worth of sugar inside. Moving on down the line, you're going to take two tablespoons worth of sugar and pour it into the green glass, making the green glass more dense. And finally, you're going to take three tablespoons worth of sugar and pour it into the last blue cup, making that water the most dense of the four cups. Now after all the sugar is placed in the different cups, take your stir and just stir it up so it's nice and evenly mixed in each of the cups. All right, now that we have all the sugar dissolved in all the glasses, take your turkey baster and your test tube or thin glass and start at the thickest density of water, which would be the blue cup. Go ahead and get a good amount of that blue water into the baster and just squeeze it into the tube. Now this water has the most density, so it goes on the bottom. The next step, take some of the green water and just lightly squeeze that into the tube. And you'll notice that it sits on top of the blue. That's because this water has a little less density than the one on the bottom. Do the same process. Pour some of the yellow right on top of the green water. And you'll get the same kind of color separation. And last but not least, the least dense water, which would be the red, goes right on top of the yellow. Voila! You should have a test tube rainbow. I hope your experiment looks as good as this, and thanks for trying it. 